A gente, graças a Deus, não chega a passar fome totalmente, mas a criança só não vive de feijão e arroz, não é verdade? Então é muito complicado nisso, é muita situação que não é fácil. Sinceramente, não é fácil. Nutrition during, particularly during the, the thousand days between a woman's pregnancy and the child's second birthday, is absolutely critical and foundational to a child's future health and development. A child that is not well nourished, there could be many causes. Most people think of food as the, as a primary cause. They don't have enough food, and that is true in a lot of cases. Uh, but um, it's often also as a result of uh, disease. Uh, that children you know, lose, especially infants, young babies, lose the nourishment because they get sick. They have bouts of diarrhea, frequent diarrhea, and that causes them to become malnourished. So it's important that, that there be clean water and sanitation, for example. The malnutrition also comes as a result of uh, poor caregiving practices on the part of the, the mom, the caregiver. If she's not nurturing the child, that can also contribute to the child not being able to really um, flourish. A mother who is an undernourished mother is somebody who was an undernourished girl. And an undernourished girl becomes an undernourished woman and a mother and give birth to a low birth weight baby. And the cycle just repeats and repeats, so you will have generations of children who are undernourished. A child who is an undernourished child who is just sitting like this, is not bothered to explore the environment, doesn't want to do things because he doesn't have energy. So the learning gets affected by it. A child who participates, runs around, is active, is learning because all his reflexes make him get information and knowledge from the sensory stimulation. We think that we don't have malnutrition in the United States, but malnutrition exists here in this country and it's called obesity. Uh, obesity is a form of malnutrition. Uh, and in many cases you have obese children um, that are also malnourished from a nutrient standpoint. So they're getting a lot of calories, but they're not getting a lot of good nutrients. They're not getting the vitamins and minerals from the, the food um, that they eat because the food that they eat is unfortunately uh, garbage. And the worst part of it is, it is not a disease that we don't have a cure for. It can be a problem of, of poverty. Um, of economic access to good, healthy food, and it is preventable with just a few uh, actions um, in terms of good nutrition and and, uh, and the right caregiving practices. Thank you. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah.